this is Tim from the Islington Centre for English with my latest super quick grammar lesson for you. Today we're going to look at the difference between will and going to. Now will and going to can be used in lots of lots of different situations but today we're just going to look at two very basic examples for you but very common, very useful I think. Firstly we're going to look at will for spontaneous decisions. Ah, I'll answer it. Tim, do you know someone who could post this letter for me? I'll post this letter for you. Thank you. I'll do it, no problem. I would also really fancy a cup of tea right now. A cup of tea? Yes. Oh, no problem. Well, I've got a kettle right here, so I'll make you one. No so problem. Nice of you. Thanks. You're very welcome, Annalena. I'll do it. Love a cup of tea. So, will for spontaneous decisions. Going to, on the other hand, can be used for a prediction based on evidence. So you see something and you make a decision about what's going to happen in the future based on what you've seen. TNT, it's going to blow, it's going to blow up, it's going to explode, hopefully not. Oh, look at those dark clouds, it's going to, that's right, it's going to rain. <laughs> Very good, look at this video, it's so good. Yeah, I can tell it's going to get a lot of likes and a lot of new subscribers on YouTube. Very good. Um, right, test time. Will or going to? Okay, well I hope you got those right and if you enjoy the videos please don't forget to subscribe to us and click like on the videos. We're trying to do a new video every week. It's quite a new thing for us and we're really enjoying it. So please do subscribe and I'll see you next time.